Hey, Creative Design here, coming out with another tutorial, and this tutorial is going to be on how to make a seamlessly looking endless floor effect in Cinema 4D. Now, this effect is actually quite simple, and I'm just delete all this and get started from scratch. So basically, um, I'm just going to add a text. I'm going to add some text. A text fail. Um, add some text. Um, put it in the middle, and put it at about 150. So that looking good. Then I'm gonna add a floor. Now, at this point, people may think that um the floor will go on forever. Wait, I'm just add um make it uh bluish color, baby blue, or sky blue. Yeah, and just apply that to the floor like so. Never know that out. Now, as you can see, there's this hard line right here that um distinguish it from the nothing there to the floor now if I was to just texture the text like so and add a couple of lights I'm gonna make it like make the radius 500 and let's put it up there and then if I render that out now it fades out um this is a kind of cool effect but it's not what we're going for so I'm just reduce the light because I think that light's a bit too bright. And I'm just render that out. Much better. Okay, next. Um add um but now let's add, add a background like so. And I'll apply the same texture to the background. Um same texture, yeah. I said it right. So and if I render that out, as you can see there's still that little little black line right there and the colors are not actually the same either now to fix this is actually quite simple all you have to do is right click on the floor go to cinema 4d tags and compositing then click then tick um, compositing background and it has to render that out now as you can see now everything is seems to be the same same color and then just to make it look more like a floor, I'm gonna add shadows like so. And there we go, there are your shadows. Next, if you want to like add a sky object and add a HDRMI to give it some reflections, um, like so, and like that, if you were to render that out, it takes away your background, so that's a little problem. And basically, how to fix this problem is right click on the sky, go to Cinema 4D tags, and compositing once more. Now, untick scene by camera, and then render it out again. Now, you still have your reflections, and everything looks still look good, but your background is still there. So, thanks guys for watching, and another tutorial will be coming out on Saturday. So, look forward to that, and peace.